Hi, I've already published videos about 3D racing game, 3D shooter, and now I thought what else is Construct 3 capable of? So in this video I'll show you a game with shooting mechanics, full 3D transport, shopping, and a dialogue system. Also if I don't stop going crazy I'll try to add as many details to the game as possible. And all this in order to find out the limits of the capabilities of Construct 3 in 3D. This video is not really a tutorial but rather an experiment. Well, let's check out what Construct 3 is capable of. First of all I created shooter mechanics and enemies as I did in another video on my channel. I also added decorations in the form of trees and a skybox. Trees are made in the same way as enemies, a certain sprite is attached to one of the faces of a 3D object. But usually there is more than one type of weapon in games so I also added an automatic rifle. For weapons I've also added ammo that drops out of enemies. And yes now the enemies have ammo but don't shoot at you, I'll fix it later. Next I have already made a video about 3D racing but there was no fully 3-dimensional car in that video. Yes we can use plugins to create 3D but I want to test exactly the capabilities of Stock Construct 3. Well, to do this I created two separate 3D objects with their own textures and a 2D sprite with the behavior of a car. After that I created an event that permanently attaches these two objects to the sprite. Then I added a boolean variable responsible for whether the player is in the car and an event that moves the camera and changes control. Yes now this card looks like it was drawn by a blind child but if you get better textures for this car then it will clearly look better. However here we see one of the problems of Construct 3, in this engine the shapes of 3D objects are very limited. But we can use angular 3D objects to create something really important. Do you want to know what? I wrote a blog post a while ago about why I f***ing hate video games. Because this is what it does, it appeals to like the male fantasy. I need this city to create a weapon shop. Here player can buy ammo and talk to the salesman. How it works. To take advantage of something that is in front of him I created a sprite that is always slightly ahead of the player. When this sprite touches a car cartridges in a store or a seller a certain event is triggered. I almost forgot about the enemies. They can shoot now. So, now we have a shooting mechanics, enemies, a 3D car, dialogues, and a store. I also added melee combat, yes I took these hands from Skyrim, tree felling and Tommy Versetti, but now that the game has so many mechanics, does this mean that Construct 3 is perfect for creating 3D games? Obviously, no. I spent a lot of time creating a simple shooting and it still doesn't work perfectly. If you look closely at the game you can see visual bugs. Also you cannot create complex 3D models in Construct 3. Of course you can buy a special plugin for 3D but do you know what will be even easier and at the same time for free? Use a game engine that is suitable for full-fledged 3D games. Construct 3 is a great game engine for 2D and 2.5D games, but I would create something complicated on it just out of curiosity. However, this is just my opinion. If you think otherwise, you can always write about it in the comments. I always read them. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.